Hello and welcome to HSQE TV. I'm David White, Group HSQE Manager. To help make the network even safer, we're going to take a look at close calls today and talk about what makes a good close call. So what is a close call? A close call is defined as anything that has the potential to cause harm or damage. This includes the potential to harm a person, including minor major injuries and fatalities, harm the environment or protected species, damage railway infrastructure, plant, vehicles, tools and equipment, systems and information. A close call should never be confused with a near miss, which specifically involves trains or on-track plant. What is the difference between a close call and an incident? A close call is something that could happen, an incident has already taken place. For example, if a trip hazard is spotted, it can be reported as a close call, because someone could trip over it. If someone actually trips because of a hazard, it's classed as an incident. What do you see if you see a close call? Safety is everyone's responsibility. So use these three steps if you see something that could cause harm or damage. One, recognise. Could it cause harm or damage? Two, respond. What can you do? Fix the situation if you can safely, then report it. Always speak up when you see unsafe behaviour, then report it. And tell people around you so they know if there is a risk. And three, report. Always report a close call. Why should you record a close call? When you record a close call, we have more information to act on. As a business, we might see a trend or identify changing needs. We can make changes to everyone stays safe, whether they are out on the track or in the office. We need to know about any problems or dangerous behaviour. You don't tell us, we can't do anything to change things. So what is a good close call? A good close call helps us work better together across the network and learn from our experiences. A good close call helps us save time by not having to call back because we don't have enough information. If every close call was made a good call, we'll be able to A, act faster to remove risk from the network, B, prioritise risk, make sure that high priority calls are handled quickly, and C, speed up the process so you get feedback faster. By improving the quality of information, we will be able to turn close call data into learning to make changes to how we work and what we do. This will make the rail infrastructure even safer and more efficient. There are three elements of a good call. One, location. A precise position is required for line side close calls. This reduces risk by helping a colleague go to the correct location for the first time with a permit if necessary. If you have the engineer's line reference, the ELR, the mileage, the chains, up and down lines, and type, that is great. The nearest station or delivery unit, the DU, have the next best options. The location cabinet reference, the bridge number, the signal box number could also be provided. If you have the What Free Words app, you can provide the words for the location to match a three metre square. Although the postcode is the least useful, it is better than nothing. If you're in the office or out but not line side, then use GPS or What Free Words. If you don't have either of those, include things like road names, junctions and landmarks. Two, the problem. Describe a problem and make it clear what could go wrong. Make it clear what action you took and what action someone else needs to take. Be as precise as possible. Instead of just saying loose screw, say loose screw on the main supply switch in the ground floor stairway. Describe a threat that may exist. For example, could it produce an electric shock? Three, the solution. Help us understand how you fixed a close call or who needs to fix it. What have you done to make it better? Be clear and specific. Describe the actions you have already taken. Who should fix it if you can't or if it is not safe for you to do so. Your insight can help us speed up the process. And don't forget, you should always report a fault first then record as a close call. A fault is an unforeseen event or failure that impacts the railway operation or safety. When there is a risk to safety, you must report the fault first. Faults are taken care of as quickly as possible by teams in the area where there is a risk of harm. The fault route control systems are not linked to the close call system. 
close call is not automatically generated when a fault is reported. As a result, you should always report a fault first, then record as a close call. How can you record a close call? If you already have the RSS app on your smartphone, use this to record a close call. Alternatively, go to the website and fill in the short online form. This information will go to the HSQE team and we will act on it. We need to increase the frequency and quality of our close calls so we can keep everyone safe. Thank you for your time today. I'm David White, Group HSQE Manager. Join me again soon for another edition of HSQE TV. Take care, stay safe.